can only play what Max Roll says, 150 GR, solo clear. If it's not on the variant, I'm not doing it. It turned me loose in the nervous hospital. It does well. All right, how about it, y'all? You got Hogs Channel. Y'all, y'all awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, y'all know how to make this Southern man smile. I'll tell you what, I did not expect anybody to think my stuff was cool or funny or stupid or even worth the engagement or a like or anything so thank y'all so much for the growth i'm kind of blown away uh we've been working on the channel just man maybe five days so please keep the growth up hit subscribe if you ain't done it i'm gonna try to do videos every single day even though i'm tired and i have a real business and stuff to do i'm hooked on bringing y'all videos so make it worth my while i'll make it worth y'all's while at least give you a good laugh or give you something to think about so on that note now max roll Let's talk about Max Roll. I'm just going to do a little fireside chat or uh, shed side chat, as I like to say. I'm in my, my work sheds where I game from. It might be a little hot, so you might hear a ceiling fan in the background. Sorry about that. But listen, now let's talk about Max Roll, okay? The truth about Max Roll. And I'm not fixing to sit here and start talking shit about Max Roll, I promise you. But I'm going to give you something to look at, okay? I'm going to give you another view on the game. So, yeah, the game is about pushing and items and optimization and all of this, right? It's about having fun with your buddies. It's about this. I play with so many people, and I'm a people person. I make friends with the devil. I love meeting new people. I can talk to a, uh, a brick wall, you know. I can watch paint dry, be friends with the paint, you know. It's just it's how I am. When I was growing up, my nickname was Mouth of the South. So, uh so many people that I play with look at Max Roll like the word of the Lord, like the word of Rex, the word of Wajito. Praise be to Wajito. Like these, y'all, don't get me wrong. Now, I'm not, I'm not, I'm talking a little shit just in fun. These guys are phenom players, right? I'm not. You know, I'm a fishing guy. That's what I do for a living. I'm not a pro gamer. Now, would I love for this channel to be successful? and I get to show y'all stuff like that and make some money, that would be kick-ass. But, like, I have a real job, 35 years old. So are a lot of my buddies, all of my buddies. You know, we're grown. We have a real job. So that's Wajito's job, right? This is Rax's job. They made this. They're the experts. They know every intricacy of this damn game. Like, if you want to go down a rabbit hole... Start looking at area damage and the formula on how it's calculated and the the collision box versus the hit box versus the center versus all these formulas. It is way beyond my knowledge, okay, or my even intent to have that knowledge. Yeah, it was an interesting read to see how the game worked, but I don't need to go that far in depth, right? Okay, so it's a great tool, but that's what it is. It's not the Bible. It's not the word of, of Diablo. It's not, if it's not this way, don't do it. So, so many guys will come in and, and say, well, it's not a max roll like that. Or why are you doing that build that way? Max roll says to do it this way. Well, right. Well, I'm not doing a GR 150 solo push. You know, I'm not doing uh, four people metas or whatever. Like, I guess what I'm trying to say is you ain't got to adhere 100% to Max Roll's guides. Those guides are there to give you the best possible optimization of items, the best build, the best everything, because what these gentlemen have done is they've built a calculator or a designer or whatever you want to call it, okay? So they've taken every bit of the mechanics of the game and they've made it to where they can just plug and play all these items in here. And they know instantly, I don't have to waste my time playing or any of that, figuring out, theory crafting. They can just do it a couple of days before the season, and that's that, right? Okay. Y'all, that's part of the fun of the game to me. I like tinkering with stuff. I like theory crafting. I like seeing, okay, Desiree's magnum opus, it's got this new buff, and if I pair it with this item, then it might be able to do this. It might be able to do that. Guys, you don't have to, cl you don't have to clear GR... 150 every time you log on the game. You know, you could be perfectly content with running GR90 speeds and playing with things. Like, don't get burned out of the game, right? I think that's why a lot of folks get burned out because they get so in tune with this guide 
and they lose track of what makes the game fun, playing around with stuff. It's not just a farm game. It's not farming simulator. You know, you're not getting in here and, ah, I got to go play Diablo 3 today. <laughs> right? That's not, that's not what's happening. The game is supposed to be fun. The game is supposed to be rewarding. So, you know, just don't treat this like if it ain't on here, you can't play. Or if, you know, if you go to uh, the Triangle's Death Nova and, wow, this is, this is South Georgia internet right here. Golly. You know, if you come in here and you see that, okay, I maybe not want frailty. I want to try something else. It could break the build. It could not, you know, experiment with it. Have a little fun with it. I um, mean, this is the time to do it because of the sanctimonious powers and all the stuff that we're getting. And now's the time to play around because you're going to get a lot of these. Uh, but I just want to, you know, me and a couple other people were talking about it. And I think so many people lose sight of the end goal of the game. That's to have fun. You know, make sure you're having fun with a game. And and sometimes having fun with a game is is doing things that are outside the scope of it a little bit. You know, I can't tell you how many people I've seen already that are running, um, you know, different, different runes of Meteor. They run an Ice Comet, and they're doing all this. Well, if you look at Max Roll, it says run Star Pack. You know, like, don't miss out on having fun in the game because you've limited yourself. You've put on these blinders to say I can only play what Max Roll says, 150 GR, solo clear. If it's not on the variant, I'm not doing it. Like, I had a blast with Endless Monk last season, and I did my own variant, and it it melted everything. Like, you know, it did 5.2 million damage. Yeah, it wasn't 6 million damage, but I don't need that. Y'all see what I'm saying? I am perfectly content with doing GR 90s, solo, you know, under two minutes uh, solo speeds or whatever the case may be. You ain't got to push all the time is what I'm getting at. So um, use it as a tool. It's a great tool. It'll get you set up. It'll tell you things you need to know. It'll tell you how the game works. It is a very valuable, it's like a service manual for the game. It gives you everything you need to know. But it's not a, you're not chained to it. You see what I'm saying? So enjoy the game. But y'all, thanks so much. Make sure you hit subscribe. I just wanted to, to sit down and have a little chat about while I'm having my coffee and I'm fixing to make a, another video for y'all about how to be richy rich in this game because this is going to be season going to be the season where you can just get flat out rich as hell so if you hadn't hit that sub button i don't know what you waiting on come on it don't it don't take nothing so anyway appreciate y'all uh pleb clan is open right so yours truly did have a better season start than you know my dude that was seven thousand paragon last season so that was my only victory i'm gonna have all season and i'm gonna wear it proudly even you know i love you brother but yeah, if y'all need to get in a clan, Pleb Clan's open. Uh, send me a message on Discord, Hog3088. That's my uh, username, Hog number 3088. Send me a message. I got we got an awesome Discord. We got guys just like me and from all what walks of life and from all over the country, actually all over the world, um, playing with us, and it's a lot of fun. And we laugh, and sometimes we get a little sidetracked, but it's a good group of friends. And you know what's even better about this stuff is. When you make friends with folks on Discord and you play with them and you ain't got to actually interact with them in real life, you don't have to worry about them stabbing you in the back and trying to steal your old lady and stealing from you and taking ideas and talking shit behind your back to everybody in town. I mean, you ain't got to worry about all that stuff that real friends do. So, anyway, thanks, y'all. We'll see you later. Hope your season 27 is going well.